Hey besties, Lucinda here, ready to slay another leak code problem. Today we're tackling the triangle problem. Basically, we gotta find the smallest path from the top to the bottom. First, let's break down the problem. We know we're getting a triangle represented as a 2D vector. We have to return an integer. The function signature is already set up, so let's pseudocode it. Okay, time for the real stuff. We'll use dynamic programming to efficiently solve this. Pseudocode time, start from the bottom and work our way up. For each number, we'll add the minimum of the two numbers below it. This is like building the path from the bottom up, ensuring we always pick the smallest root. DP current will hold the minimum path sums from the current row to the bottom. We loop from the second to last row going up. For each row, DP new stores the updated path sums. All right, we're in the end game now. Let's refine this code for peak performance. Error handling is a bit overkill for this problem since the constraints guarantee valid input. Instead, I've added comments to make it easier to understand and keep lines concise. Optimization-wise, we could technically do this in place to save even more space, but honestly, it would make the code way less readable. As it stands, the solution is efficient and easy to grasp, so we are chilling.